request out. Kim and Paul, thank you very much. Let's get right to the radar across parts of Kentucky. Uh, we're seeing a lot of thunderstorms pop up with some big winds over 60 mile per hour in gusts and some hail up to the size of golf balls. Look at this area generally that we're watching right in here. That's the area where we're watching real close right now. Let's zoom in into parts of east central Kentucky where we do have a severe thunderstorm warning out for Estelle Lee and Powell counties until 6 o'clock tonight, guys. Uh, this cluster of storms has had a history of producing in Richmond, Kentucky, right over here just to the west of Irvine. 63 mile per hour wind gust and there again as I said been some golf ball sized hail reports in that here's the hail track with this guy as it heads on off basically toward the east expect at least quarter sized hail in that so if you live in for example West Liberty or Canal City watch out for these storms moving through and here are some of the times that will be impacted by this group of storms uh, that will likely remain severe I think for the next at least half an hour or so farther to the south across parts of northern Alabama we have a cluster of thunderstorms not seen organized there but some of these have been producing some gusty winds and some hail and I'm going to slide a little farther south in Alabama near Lynn and Carbon Hill let me just show you close in what one of these storms looks like and this is what they've been doing from time to time they pop up they show a little bit of rotation in there and let me show you a cross section of what one of these guys looks like this is cool because look at this here's altitude right in here the top of the thunderstorm is poking just above 30,000 feet that little tiny pit squeak of a storm is pretty tall guys and here's the updraft right in there and so what we're seeing is a rotating updraft that is suspending uh, the raindrop from the particulate from falling down so we've got that what's called bounded weak echo region right in here and that is a sign that this storm is rotating it may produce some hail from time to time as it moves eastward across parts of northern Alabama. We've got two clusters of thunderstorms in the visible satellite pictures. Both of those are associated with cooling air aloft that's moving in and destabilizing the atmosphere. When you get the cool air aloft, that tends to help trigger thunderstorms. And we're going to see it come up over the next few hours, I think. There's a watch possible here. I think it would be a severe thunderstorm watch out for parts of Kentucky and likewise farther to the south across parts of Tennessee, Alabama, and Mississippi. Guys, stay tuned for all the latest. Back to you. All right.